Just going after Goliath. Say, so Goliath, if I leave your people alive, they may come after me. So you see, David knew, they didn't knew, my goodness, the precedent of overflow. Do not just expect overflow in your finances. Do not just expect overflow. Hallelujah in prosperity, but expect overflow even on the battlefield. Yes. Somebody say hallelujah. Yes. Over overwhelming victory. Yes. Somebody shall say hallelujah. Yes. Overwhelming victory. Yes. What you don't know, David, David knew the principle of overflow so much. He knew. The mistake that Gideon made. Gideon agreed for God to give him just 300 soldiers. So after Gideon left the scene, the next king that took over went after Gideon's children. You read the Bible. And he killed 17 of Gideon's children. Somebody said, Praise the Lord. Gideon had 300 soldiers. To fight with a daily house 600. Somebody said the overflow. You don't understand. Gideon has 300 soldiers, but daily has six. Saul killed a thousand, but daily kills a ten of thousand. Somebody said the overflow. Do not just go after the overflow in finances, in houses, and land. But when God delivers your enemies in your hands, when God when God delivered the sorcerer in your hands, when God delivered my goodness, yes, your, your enemies in your hands. Somebody said, Praise the Lord. Go for overwhelming victory. If you read the history of David, David went out of town to men and women and children. David did not leave any alive. Come on, read your Bible. I'm not making this thing. Somebody shall say hallelujah. He understood the principle of overflow. And he said, God has said, the God that created me yes, yes, yes. commanded me to do this. Yes, yes, yes. He told me not to have pity on them. What are you, my brother? What are you, my sister? Right. You did not obey the voice of God. You did not take the word of God in any concept. God told you not to touch his not to touch his anointed, right. to touch on my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Right. You know who am I in the sight of God. Right. You know who am I in the, in the hands of God. Right. You know who am I in the presence of God. Right. But you will not quit trying to call me to me. You will not quit trying to hurt me. You will not quit trying to bring me down. Now this table has been turned around in my face. The table has been turned you did not have pity on me. Why should I have pity on you? Somebody say hallelujah. Is that a witness yet? You did not have pity on me. Why should I have pity on you? Hallelujah. You did not consider me to be somebody. Why should I consider you to be somebody? But the table now is in my favor. God is preparing this table in your favor. You 
You are now the head, not the tail. You are now above, not the knee. The table, the table is now turned in your favor. Somebody say glory to God. I'm saying that is, I'm saying that by what God showed me. The table has now been turned in your favor. The victory is sure. The victory is sure. The victory is sure. The table is now turned in your favor. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. And they have pity on you. Hallelujah. All this year it went tormenting you. Now, finally, God heard the prayer. Say, never God heard the prayer. Say, never God heard the prayer. Say, never God heard the prayer. As he will be dealing with tomorrow. Oh, glory to God. Oh, Lord. Come by next week and get the conclusion of the message. We're going to be talking about the inside of this week. Somebody say hello. Come on, God bless you. You overcome one enemy. Then you have to start to deal with the inside. Because the inside will discover that say the outsider can't get you. And you are in the position to go places, wow. jealousy will rise. Right. Right. Envy will rise. Yeah, right. Some of us say hallelujah. hallelujah. Goliath was an outsider. Yeah. He did not go after David because of envy or jealousy. Yeah. He was an outsider. He knew nothing about David. Right. But one of the difficult group of people to deal with are those that know something about you. Come on, that's what they hear. Those that know something about you are the group of questions that you have to deal with. Group of jealous folks that you have to deal with. Group of angry folks that are hard to deal with. Because they know something about you. Hallelujah. But they do not know who is backing you. Somebody say hallelujah. This morning, the table has been turned in your favor. In no time to be pitiful or to have mercy. God told me to bring you down, I'm bringing you down. I'm bringing you down. I love God, get me the instruction. It's not by my own way, but by the will of God Almighty. I'm bringing you down. Come on, shout it, hallelujah. It's not, it's not by my own way. But I don't God gave me the instruction. And he delivered me in your hands. 
because he had given you grace periods yes, to has. quit and you will not quit. Will not quit. He had given you grace periods to, hallelujah, to quit, yes, but yes. you will not quit. Yes. He had warned you to yes. stop yes. and you will not stop. The devil believe yes. here. He had warned you to stop and you will not stop. He had given you grace periods to leave him alone. Leave him
of the host of the Philistines this day unto the fowls of the yes. air yes. and to the wild beasts of the earth. Yes. That all the earth may know that there is a God in our midst. Yes. Say, neighbor, there is a God in our midst. Yes. Are we serving a God? Yes. Are we serving Jehovah God? Yes. Is the present with us? Yes. Is the present of the Lord with us? The spirit of fear. But Lord, power and a sound. We got to use the power for something. We got to use the God given power for something. Hallelujah. You just have to keep yourself holy. So, neighbor, just keep yourself holy. That the Holy Ghost will work with you. Keep yourself holy. That the angels of God will hang on with you. Keep yourself holy. That the angels of God will be around you. Keep yourself holy. No witchcraft will bring you down. Say, neighbor, just keep yourself holy. Keep yourself holy. Keep yourself holy. That the Holy Ghost will work with you, work through you, and be around you. Holy angels will hang out with you. We are standing on holy ground. And I know that our angels were all around you. Hallelujah. Keep yourself holy. That the angels of God will always be there around you. And David says, Goliath, let me tell you. This thing will not be done in secret. Our victory will not be done in secret. I'm going to say, neighbor, neighbor, your victory your will not be done in secret. So get that believe. It will not be done in secret. And this is what David is saying here in the 47th verse. And when Goliath, when God deliver you in our hands, yes. all this assembly shall know that the Lord do not save with sword or with spear, right. for this battle is the Lord. Right. Hallelujah! This battle is not ours anymore; That's it right. belongs to the Lord. Yes. And he will give you into our hands. Is all the Lord is saying here this morning? Goliath, your defeat will not be in secret. Witchcraft, your defeat will not be in secret. Sorcerer, your defeat will not be in secret. Who among us? Headers, your defeat will not be in secret. It will be broadcast yes, that all our wishes will know about yes, us. Yes, that our God is with yes, us. Yes, this battle is not mine. Say, neighbor, yes, this battle is not yes, yours. Yes, Can you shake it with seven people? Say, neighbor, yes, no matter yes, what you've been going through, yes, they are coming to my end. This battle is not yes, yours. Yes, this battle is belong yes, to the Lord. Oh, come on. This battle is not yours. See the end to your struggle. See the end to your struggle. See the end. See the end to your struggle. See the victory to your struggle. Somebody shall say hallelujah. This battle is not yours. See the end. See the end to your struggle. See the end. See victory. See victory. See the end to your struggle. This battle is no more yours. It belongs to the Lord. Yours anymore. That's right. But God, today, God is bringing you yeah. into the overflow. Into the overflow. Somebody say overflow. overflow. Oh, I can't get somebody. Yeah. Shout the overflow. There's no more devil portion but overflow. Today, there's no more devil portion but overflow. Then it says, My God.
a long time. He said, this is one of the secrets for your overflow. Are you ready for the secret? Yes, yes. Say, neighbor, are you ready for the secret? Yes, yes. Hallelujah. This is one of the secrets of overflow. Luke chapter 6, verse 10, it says, Give. There is a victory in giving. Sure is, sure is. It is blessed to give than to receive. Here is Jesus speaking to us, confirming the overflow spirit that David been preaching to us. Give and it shall be given unto you. Well, good work. I can't hear you. Good measure. Good measure, not evil measure. Not, not negative measure. Be not deceived, for God is not mocked. Whatever a man sow, that shall he receive. Is that what the Bible says? The Bible says, give good things. Give, and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, yeah. press down, yeah. press down to make more room. Right. Oh, you don't understand. Yeah. You put put some things in here, and you want more room. You press it down, yeah. press down. Good measure, good measure is being pressed down. Right. Is that right? Yes, right? Good deeds have been pressed down. Yeah. Uh, who the Lord talking to right. here? Yeah. Don't you know you can press money down to get more room for money? Oh, the Lord. Say, good measure. Good measure. Good measure. Press down. So down, when you, when you press down, you got to shake it. Shake it together. Is that what the Bible is saying here? Good measure. Somebody say, glory to God. Glory to God. Give and it shall be given unto you. Good measure. Press down and shake it together. Wow. Run it over. Somebody say, run it over. Oh, who the Lord talking to here? Run it over. Can I preach to you now? Shake it together. Yes, yeah. Good, good. Get it. It shall be given unto you. Good measure. Press down. Shake it together. Run it over. Shall men give unto your bosom? Is that right? Shall men give well unto your measure? Come on now. Shall what? Men give well unto your bosom. For with the same measure that ye may well well, it shall be what measure unto you. Shake it over. Hands down, shake it over, run it over, shall men give unto your bosom. Hallelujah. There are some folk that cannot be blessed to bless you. There are some folk that cannot be healed to the bless you. There are some folk that cannot be delivered to leave you alone. There are some folk that cannot be, come on now. There are some folk that cannot be happy. Until they leave you alone, there are some folks that cannot come into the blessing until they bless you, until they leave you alone, until they embrace you, until they keep the whole you are and get away with you. There are some folks. Ah, so neighbor, watch out the blessing that's coming. Even your enemies will bless you. Oh, who the Lord? Oh, yeah. 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 Even your enemies will bless you. Yeah. Yeah. If they want to live, they got to bless you. Yeah. If they, they want to be here, they got to bless you. Yeah. 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 If they want to be delivered, yeah. they got to bless you. Yeah. Yeah. If they want to be successful, they just got to bless you. Yeah. 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 Because God said it, and I believe it. Over. 
Shout it! 